sound an alarm in my holy mountain. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble, for the day of the Lord cometh, and it is nigh at hand. A day of darkness and of gloominess, a day of clouds and of thick darkness. As the morning spread upon the mountains, a great people and a strong, there hath not been ever the like, neither shall be any more after it, even to the years of many generations. A fire devoureth before them, and behind them a flame burneth. The land is as the garden of Eden before them, and behind them a desolate waste. Yea, and nothing shall escape them. The appearance of them is the appearance of horses, and as horsemen, so shall they run. Like the noise of chariots on the tops of mountains, they shall leap. Like a noise of a flame of fire that devoureth the stubble, as a strong people set in battle array, before their faces the people shall be much pained. All faces shall gather blackness. They shall run like mighty men. They shall climb the wall like men of war. They shall march every one on his ways. And they shall not break their ranks. Neither shall one thrust another. They shall walk every one in his path. And when they fall upon the sword, they shall not be wounded. They shall run to and fro in the city. They shall run upon the wall, they shall climb up on the houses, they shall enter in at the windows like a thief. The earth shall quake before them, the heavens shall tremble, the sun and the moon shall be dark, and the stars shall withdraw their shining. And Yah shall utter his voice before his army, for his camp is very great, and he is strong that executeth his word. For the day of the Lord is great and very terrible. Who can abide it? Therefore also now, saith Yah, turn ye to me with all your heart, and with fasting, and with weeping, and with mourning, and rend your heart, and not your garments. Turn unto Yah your Elohim, for he is gracious and merciful, slow to anger, and of great kindness, and repenteth him of the evil. <laughs> 